A pleasant morning to everyone. Today I am going to say the basic introduction of the first chapter in 9th class that is cell, its structure and functions. First let us know some of the important points regarding the discoveries. In 1595 Jacaris Johnson discovered the compound microscope. In 1663 Robert Hooke discovered the cell. Uh, from the air time of 1632 to 1723, his lifetime, Anthony von Leeuwenhoek, he is known as the father of microbiology. With the help of the simple microscope, he had observed the bacteria, protozoa and animal sperm cells. Robert Brown discovered nucleus in the year 1831. In 1839, Purkinje coined the term protoplasm. In 1931, Ernest Truska had discovered the transmission electron microscope. Albert Claudet is the father of cell biology. In 1839, Theodor, he is a geolo geologist, and Sleden, he is a botanist. They both together proposed the cell theory. In the year 1855, Rudolf Karl-Wichow discovered the cell division. What is the uh, important thing to note is that from the discovery of the cell to cell theory, there is a 200 years gap. Now, let us know some of the basic points regarding the cell. Cell is the structural, functional and basic unit of life. So, functional means the cell is capable of carrying all the living functions. Uh, how we can say cell is the basic unit of life means, in our life the primary basic unit is cell. A group of cells form the tissue, a group of tissues form the organ, and group of organs form the organ system, and group of organ systems form the organism what we are. The word cell is derived from the Latin word cellula, meaning small compartments. I have said that it was discovered by Robert Hooke in the year 1663. So he discovered it from the cork of an oak tree. The cells are different in size, shape and functions. So this is the basic introduction of the chapter cell, its structure and functions. Thank you.